Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to Scribble Not Unmasked. Today we are continuing on with our adventure by heading off to another area. I think that last episode we were in, of course, the planet of Owa, and now we wanted to move to a different place. So just unlock a whole new area, and there's this area to the left. It is, I could select it, it's not really letting me select it right now. There it is. Okay, it is the Bella Reeve. 2,120 is our current balance. We need 2,000 to get into this, so let's buy it. See what we can do in here. I don't know what Bella Reeve is, so it's gonna be a learning experience for me. There's only so much I know about DC Comics, to be honest with you, I know more about Marvel. The late rare of penitentiary, involuntary home of the Suicide Squad. A prison? This looks like Bella Reeve? I, I guess so. Oh, and there's uh, Harley Quinn. They finally threw you in here too, huh, Bobble Gang, da Bobble Danger. Huh, I guess she thinks I'm the doppelganger. Better play along. Yeah, I'm, cause I'm too much of a bad guy, am I right? I guess I tricked people with rotten apples one too many times. Oh, aren't you a little rooster after my own heart? Haven't you heard though? We're the good guys now, or sometimes, at least while we're in here. And I'm getting out of this joint soon enough. What was that? Anywho, did you hear about the, that new prisoner they brought in? Sounds like a real macho man if you ask me, though he's too crazy even for my tastes. Who is that? Well, anyways, I gotta do some something better than talking to you. Later, M M Mr. G. Mr. G? Okay. Well, goodbye. Uh, so yeah, we're in this area. I did wanna take a look around. Is there actually something we can do when it comes to uh, getting a star right? Probably, I would be weird if not every single area has like a star right thing, especially since we already just got some story exhibition about something Harley Quinn is doing. I would love to find out what that is, but I don't actually see anything. But I haven't explored absolutely everything, so I just gotta keep moving. This is some kind of high-end jail for all the baddest of the bad guys. Oh gosh, uh, Sportsmaster 2 is hypnotized. Do I have to beat you up? Okay, create a new object. We're gonna go ahead and take out um, a katana, a sword. That'd be cool, right? I would like it. There we go, except, there we go. So, hiya! Well, I do have to fight you, right? That's the idea, destroy Maxwell, not anymore, sir. Who are you, by the way? Oh, is it too late? I think so. Oh, you're evil, you're just as evil as me. This is Behemoth. Oh gosh, um, oh wow, one hit takedown. <laughs> Was that it? They didn't give me any points though, so maybe I didn't do that successfully. I don't know how to get down there. There was a, uh, an elevator over this way. Maybe I should have taken this. I think this is an elevator, it looks like it to me. Indeed it is. Okay, so on this floor, what do we got? We got this kid dancing. Stand in line for me while I run to the bathroom. The waiting game. Wait, are we seriously just waiting in line for this guy? Who are these people? Simon and Dr. Phosphorus. I wanna learn about these guys in a moment, but let me just keep waiting for this kid first. Do I, am I actually expected just to wait here for long enough or am I supposed to do something? I was gonna wait just for now, like 10 more seconds. Yeah, I don't know who that guy is who's like made of clouds. There's a lot of weird stuff going on in this game. I hear the book is better. Oh yeah, because we're waiting in front of a movie theater, which also features Maxwell and some posters. This can't be what we're doing. Okay, probably shouldn't have done that, but I did. Maybe if I destroy everybody else, it was, no, don't destroy the movie theater. Wait, whoa, 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 dinosaur? No, no, I told you to wait for me. I tried, but you, wait, you took too long. Get the dinosaur out of here. I haven't gotten any points yet. Oh, and he's running away. Jeez, this is this is a mess. I destroyed one guy. I got, it was Simon. We got Dr. Phosphorus. What, what are you about? Alex Sartorius was exposed to red hot radiated sand following a nuclear core meltdown. Now his body turns to flame whenever it touches air. Seeking revenge for the accident, Dr. Phosphorus attacks the people who hired him to work at the plant. This put him, puts him into conflict with Batman, who inevitably stops him, vowing revenge on all of Gotham. Dr. Phosphorus plans on seeing the entire city burned to the ground. See also Batman. Okay, well there's that guy. Learn a little bit more about him. And we got Mist 2. Don't know who Mist 1 is, but this is Mist 2. The daughter of the original Mist. This villainous young woman can turn people or objects invisible. Wow. So I don't know what I was supposed to do about that. We got Clayface 2 over here too. Is this the daughter of Clayface? The second villain to take the name Clayface is Matt Hagen, a treasure hunter who immerses himself in a pool of radioactive material, giving him the power to change his body into any form. He commits to a life of crime, fighting the dynamic duo of Batman and Robin. And this is Clayface 1, I suppose. 
Interesting. So, so far I've ruined every single opportunity I've had to make some more reputation, which is just great. <laughs> Are you okay over here, kid? No, you're just upset about not making it to the movies, I guess. Sort of, you know, went before he had to go to the theater, to be honest with you. Ever think there's another version of you in a different universe? Yeah? Are you, are you trying to suggest something? Like if I just spawn in Green Lantern? Would that be what you want? L.A. Hal Jordan. No, wait, that's the one you are. Dang it. Come on. Not what I wanted. Uh, I mean, maybe it is. Different version of you from a different universe. So maybe we should try that. Green. Hal Jordan. Accept. There you go. No, that did nothing. But wait, now you need something. Iron Maiden has a task. I don't understand what this guy wants. What does Iron Maiden want? This thing. Uh, my next victim is around here. Fill me with Clayface 2. So we know Clayface 2. We picked him up. Oh, well, we didn't pick him up, but we saw him over here before. So I need to, wait, why, why down here? There you go. Um, I need to go get him real fast. Maybe we can make him portable. And also, while, while we're doing that, let's create a new adjective for uh, Maxwell as well. Let's make him fast. Fast. That'll just be a little bit easier. Oh, did that not work? Don't think it did. Uh, F-A-S-T, fast, accept, there you go. Yeah, it's way better. So for you, I'm just gonna pick you up if I can. I might have to remove my sword and then go to Clayface and pick him up. There we go. No, I don't deserve this. I mean, I really don't know. I think you've probably done something bad. Oh, ah, ah, why? No, no, don't attack me. Don't attack me. Hold on, hold on. Fire and brimstone. I mean, sure, but wait. Oh yeah, from over there. Phil, quickly. Phil, quickly, come on. I know he doesn't like Clayface, but I, I need him. There we go, feed me Max while I did it. Okay, so you guys, calm down, would you? Okay, so let's go ahead and do this. I must have missed this before. Interact, fire and brimstone. Here is our little mission. <laughs> what was happening there? Sometime later, Maxwell finds himself being volunteered. What's going on? You, rooster, who the heck are you? Are you Rooster? Yeah, because he looks like a Rooster with his hat. Amanda Waller. You know what? I don't care. Congratulations. You are now officially a part of the Task Force X, AKA the Suicide Squad. Aren't those the guys who go on missions are dangerous or not expected to survive? Great. We have a code red situation. Brimstone has broken loose and is going haywire. And you've been volunteered to help contain the situation. Volunteered? More like voluntold. First things first, Brimstone fried the control panel on this door. We need to throw the manual override that's on the floor above us. Colonel Flag has gone ahead, but I haven't heard back. Better do what she says, Maxwell. I'm detecting a star right somewhere below you. I'd bet my bottom dollar that that Brimstone has it. On my way. So it looks like we're a criminal for the day. So we gotta head downwards. Uh, I figured it was gonna be through that big door, but maybe not. Yeah, wait, how do we get, or maybe we have to go up. Okay, big door's mysterious. So I can't quite go down there. Let me go ahead and make myself fast again, because that's something it took away. But it's just so much more useful when I can go quickly. So let's figure this out. Is there anybody over here? I don't think so. Oh no, there is. So I have to destroy these guys. Well, I can bring up the katana again. Honestly, the katana was really useful. Oh, I can't. Oh, because, wait, you create a new object. I think I was doing an adjective. Katana, here you go. So let's try to help out with these guys as much as I can. I don't know if this is actually working or not. I mean, it is, I'm just not destroying many of them very quickly. Oh, this guy's named Katana. Oh, that's a weird coincidence. Katana is a Japanese sword and martial arts expert. Did I spawn this guy in by accident? Her sword, the Soul Taker, was once possessed by the spirit of her husband, Takio. Takeo, maybe? A superhero whose hunt for Takeo's assassins continues to haunt her. Katana has had affiliations with the Outsiders, Birds of Prey, and is now the member of Amanda Waller's Justice League of America, uh, AKA Tatsu Yamashiro. Great. So I can create another one of her just to help me out. Ow, no, you're attacking me! No, why are you attacking me? Leave me alone. Be gone. Can I, un I, I brought you into this world, can I bring you out? Yeah, I think. Oh, I gotta pull the lever. Gotta pull the lever, right? Interact. All right, now it's back to the, head back to the scary later, uh, lady, okay. You guys have fun. <laughs> I'm out of here. Goodbye. 
Okay, so running back this way, I have you. I see you activated the override. Good work, we may live through this yet. Now, we can get down there, but we still don't have a way to take down the brimstone. There's a plasma rifle in storage two floors, up, two floors up in the storage that should do some damage. You, Rooster, get up there, get that plasma rifle, and give it to Deadshot. He's the only one who can make that shot. If sent Quinn, I, I've sent Quinn on ahead, but she probably got distracted by something shiny. Well, that's a little rude. But uh, let's try to figure this out. We're at the top now. And we're supposed to be finding this awesome weapon of awesomeness. Oh, my squad is out fighting Brimstone and you gotta do something. See, so yeah, it's in one of these boxes, huh? All right, well, I'll do what I can. It's not in that one. I don't even know what that is. Uh, What was it? Some more steel boxes. It won't tell me. Oh, I, I broke it, that's why. That's not it. I think the plasma rifle is in one of these boxes. I'm working on it. Oh, we broke our sword though. Let me go ahead and get like, something maybe a little bit more practical, like a chainsaw. That sounds very practical. Uh, There you go, chainsaw, except. This seems good, ooh, this is perfect. That's not it, it's in one of these, that's for sure. Oh, that broke into a smaller box. Maybe it's not in here at all. No, there it is, awesome, so I'm gonna go ahead and pick that up. Strong box, Harley Quinn, pick up, don't break it. Oh, you found it, get back to the boss lady as soon as possible, ooh. Whoa, the shots are hard to see, but they look effective. So go back down this way. All right, scary lady, I got it. Get that rifle to Deadshot. Where is Deadshot at? This is another katana. So that really was just like a weird coincidence. This is not doing any damage to you. Weird, okay. Who else do we have here, by the way? Like, first off, Brinstone himself, he's huge. In an attempt to destroy all of Earth's heroes, Darkseed orders Desad to fire a Techno Seed into the experimental fug fusion generator at Star Labs causing an explosion out of which comes the villainous Brimstone. Believing himself as an avenging god, Brimstone goes on to rampa uh, rampage trying to destroy Earth's mightiest heroes. He was subsequently brought down by the Ju Justice League. Okay. Firestorm and Cosmic Boy. Those two as well. well. I don't want to create him at the moment because he's already causing a problem. Rick Flagg, the Colonel. Rick Flagg is the, ma the man in charge of the Suicide Squad 1 and and a natural born leader, he's an expert in firearm surveillance and tracking. And then, who else do we have? Brimstone, Captain Boomerang. George Digger Harkness grew up knowing his adoptive father hated him. Wow, that's sad. One day, he receives a package containing a boomerang from his biological father. Using it for pranks, George then escalated his bad behavior to robbery. After moving to Central City, George takes on the name Captain Boomerang and commits crimes coming up against the Scarlet Speed through the Flash time and time again. He was a member of the Rogues and would later join the anti-hero team called the Suicide Squad one. Okay, and then who else do we have? We still have more characters. I, I just really like learning about this stuff. Get my mind a little bit more open to everything. And we have read about Harley Quinn before, but I think this is a different Harley Quinn. Harley Quinzel, no, 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 same one. Looks a little bit different, but I think it's like still sort of kind of the same one. All right, we got Killer Croc. Born with epidermolytic hyperkeratosis, or hyperkeratosis, a rare gen genetic disorder that causes his skin to thicken and mutate, Waylon Jones is now a, the deadly and savage killer Croc. Reptilian in appearance, Croc possesses super strength and a bloodthirsty appetite for destruction. He is a member of Batman's rogues gallery. It seems to be everybody, so we're gonna help beat this guy up. Oh no, I gotta give this to Deadshot. So where is Deadshot? Gotta be around here. Oh, maybe that person who's flying around is Deadshot? Enchantress, Harley Quinn, Brimstone. Yeah, who's Deadshot again? I don't really know. I mean, I'm trying to help make this shot right now. People are getting beat up. It has to be one of you. Maybe maybe it was the boomerang guy. Or maybe it was Rick Flagg. Was that his name? Like, like his like nickname? It doesn't look like it. I'm a little confused. Maybe I missed a detail here. By saying the word enchantress, June Moon can transform into a superpowered being who was promised the ability to rid the world of evil. She has spent time as a heroic member of Shadow Pact and also as a villain at odds with Supergirl. So she is actually a hero. I thought she was just an enchantress, like randomly. Um, I could try to give it to you. Give. Will that make a difference? No, I don't think it did. I need to take that back then. Where did you go? Where, did he just get taken out? Yeah, where, where did he go? Oh no, he's right here. Steal that back from you. Steal. 
He's too busy using it, apparently. Dude, what's happening? Give me my gun back. <laughs> this is weird. Maybe just Deadshot isn't around here. I can't get it back from him. There we go. Took took long enough. It wasn't Captain Boomerang then, right? He's no, his his nickname is Digger, for whatever reason. So she's just chilling out here, Katana. Where in the world? Maybe he's just to the right over this way. No, definitely not that. Where in the world is Deadshot? Maybe I have to spawn him in myself. Maybe that's the idea. Let's try it. I mean, this is Scribble Knots after all. Um, so let's try that. D E A D S H. Okay, there we go. Got him there. And then Deadshot, give you this. That seemed to work, right? No, he took the boomerang. This is not working. <laughs> I'm gonna go, while these guys are all fighting, I'm gonna go see if I can't find a different Deadshot. This is weird. What am I doing wrong? There has to be another Deadshot around. Maybe out of all these guys that were fighting? Oh, no, 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 that was down this way. There's many, uh, whatever his name was. But I don't see him, and I can't actually get to that second floor anymore. Weird, maybe something happened. It doesn't make any sense. Because I don't know what to do anymore. Because you're just chilling out. You're not actually helping. Oh no, there you go. That isn't doing anything. Okay, so I found Deadshot. He's just floating up there. This was so weird, because I was honestly so stuck on this. Yeah, buddy, here you go, here you go. Give. Is that all we had to do? He was sort of in this weird spot where I couldn't see him. Unless, you know, you move the camera in a weird way. Oh my gosh. Maxwell, now's your chance. Help the Suicide Squad take him down, I guess. Sure. So I was actually so stuck in that I tried to look up a guide, and then I realized that Bell Reeve is actually a level added specifically for this game just for the Mega Pack. That's actually pretty cool. But also, I literally, there's no guides that exist for it right now. <laughs> so I was sort of on my own. But hey, now we can beat him up. See ya, dude. You're out of here. Quick, Maxwell, get the star right before anyone else realizes what it is. Oh boy, quickly. They are all surrounded by it, or they're surrounding it. So boom, fire and brimstone. 500 rep points for that, which is really nice. I appreciate it. All right, so very, very cool. So we'll spend the rest of today's episode trying to just get more stuff like this done. As long as my tanning bed remains active, my snakelets will continue to create chaos. As long as my tanning bed remains active. So, well, here's the tanning bed. Uh, let's just, hold on. Add adjective. B, R, O, K, E, and broken. Except, there you go. You've been destroyed, whatever you are. You actually, you're just pestilence. Um, me be hero, need hero stuff. Okay, so you need a cape. Create a new object, C-A-P-E. Create the cape and give it to the snake, right? Okay, this dude's being a jerk. I want to create another new object. No, this is an adjective. Object, and let's go ahead and get, the chainsaw worked well earlier. Might as well give that a shot. Uh, chain saw. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Hiya. He's like, ah, oh, don't hurt me. You you attacked me first. So what can we do about the dexterous viper? Maybe we could actually give it an adjective. I think caped is an adjective. Or not. Uh, let's just do heroic. Maybe that's all we need. Cause he didn't take the cape. Yep, there you go. Need hero stuff. Well, a cape is like the most hero thing. Yeah, like what else can you have? Um, Like a, a, a not, not a lock, a logo, a hero logo. You know, like Batman has his bat symbol. Maybe like a tool belt? <laughs> you know, like Batman as well. A uh, tool, no, no, no. There we go, tool belt. You don't want any of this? Let's just try like a super suit. Maybe that's something it could do. Uh, where is his super suit? I don't know, we're about to find out. Super suit. No, oh, that doesn't work. Let's just try suit then. But that would just be a business suit. I don't understand what we can do. Like, this is, this is, some of these is, don't make no sense to me. So we're leaving it, sorry buddy. Are you mad at me again, you're trying to fight me? I thought you said, ah, oh, don't hurt me. I gave you hero stuff, so I don't know what more you want. I think you're being selfish. Uh, what about this, nothing? Oh, here we go. Uh, we've been turned to stone. Heroes to stone. Oh, okay, I need to take care of the, this guy, I think. Yeah, he's turning them to stone. So let's 
Yep, there we go, I defeated them. Yeah, all heroes return from stone, 100 points. Heat me up, the patio is, wait, wait, what? Hit the target. Okay, first off, I'll help you hit these targets. Whoa, oh, it's moving quick. There we go, marksman, there's that one. What is this? It's a patio, it needs to be heated up. Create a new object, uh, a hair dryer. That might work. No, not a hair dresser, hair dryer. Accept, equip it, then use it. There you go, pull yourself together. Oh, who are you? Okay, there's Green Arrow, there's Batgirl, but who is this guy? Metamorpho. I'm gonna check him out. Composed of various elements, Metamorpho can shapeshift and transmute his form to create molecular, molecular constructs of his own design using any elements found in the human body, AKA Rex Mason, AKA the Element Man. Interesting. Well, they're all fighting, so I'm gonna get out of here. Go down one more. Maxwell, you have incoming alerts. Uh, are you ready to move on? No, I might reload this area at some point to earn more points, but for now. Okay, so our haul truck is broken and we need to get a, the, this cot past to the toll booth. What is a cot? Like, that's what I'm trying to figure out now. Like, this is a broken haul truck, first off. Uh, I'd actually, maybe just fixing it will solve my problem and solve theirs, or maybe I'll have to do more than that. We're about to find out. Fixed, accept. Was that it? That's a con, I guess. Also, who are you? You're Chrysalis. A robot designed by a prejudiced scientist by the name of Ger Gerard Eves Martet. Blaming the world's ills on immigrants, he created Chrysalis to appear friendly, but in fact, the robot contained a swarm of poisonous butterflies. Uh, somehow, Gerard found a way to pu put the evil robot onto the team, the Global Guardians, where it still works, continuing its nefarious programming. Wow, that is awful. Okay, we'll try to get there, but I need your help. Do you need me to drive? Here, I'll drive for you. No? What do you need my help with? You can't say, I need your help, and then not tell me. Can I ride it, Phil? Like, dude, <laughs> what do you want from me? Let's empty it, there we go. Give me the cot, copper cot, pick up, and I'm gonna put it back in there. Maybe that's something, like if I could drive it, that'd be great. Phil, no. Sometimes like some like actions, they just don't work sometimes. You gotta do it like multiple times for whatever reason. I can empty it and that's it. So wh whatever you want from me, can't really do it because you're not telling me what you want. And also there's there's a Hydra. Why is there a Hydra? We may never know. Maybe, maybe that's what I need to, that's in the way. Create a new object. Let's go ahead and get a blaster out. B, L, A, S, T, blaster. Accept, equip it, and let's blast this guy. Yeah, that's it. This is good work, right here. Beautiful, beautiful, gotcha. Is that what you needed? No, I broke the thing. Okay, whatever, whatever. Some of these missions are total baloney, because they don't tell you what to do. Like, it's like not really obvious whatsoever. Okay, what about you? I always wanted to meet a super pet. Altar Boy is a huge fan. A super pet, what do you mean? Like maybe one of these guys? There you go. You wanna meet a super pet? Is that, there you go, frozen dinner. Oh, that was a totally different m mission. No, not what I wanted, didn't mean to attack you. Can I still make your super pet? Like I can make, it's super dog, right? There's a dog that's like Superman, I'm pretty sure. Super pets. There you go, there you go. Super pet fan. So that seems to be everything in the area. So what I wanna quickly do is go to the world map and see how much uh, rep we have so that we can make our way to the next area, which seems to be the Teen Titans Tower, which we would need a lot more rep for that in what? Metropolis? I think so. So let's go ahead and get some Metropolis rep, try to get ourselves up to 2,000, and maybe we'll get this guy. So apparently this guy's name is Mr. Mixespitalik. That's his actual pronunciation. You can't create any object or adjective to help you fly. Oh, that's my favorite thing to do. Darn it. Okay, so what about this guy? Do we just have to beat him up? I think so. So first off, uh, let's go ahead and, I like it. I like the chainsaw a lot. It's just helpful. But hopefully there, there shouldn't be too much that will get in the way. All right, so my minions are doing something, that's for sure. Wait, this, this doesn't really do much, is it? No, I beat up one of them. I just can't see the health anymore. Uh, my minions are the source of my invincibility. So what can I do? Like maybe make a dog? Good new object, because the dog's like bones, right? Maybe I can just like spawn in Superman to help me. 
Wouldn't that be the answer to like 90% of our problems? No, that just gave her the dog. Oh, what about the scepter though? Skeleton, ghostly skeleton warrior, wizard staff. Pick it up. Okay, now I'm gonna use it to attack. Hiya. Oh, is this working? It puts him to sleep. Hey, I got you back in the grave. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so before we do anything else, let's see, yeah, let's check out what the grandma wants. I want to help fight crime. Can you give me some something heroes use? Uh, I could give you this. That didn't work. Okay, so let's go ahead and give you a batarang. <laughs> something like that, All right? That'd be pretty good. Or maybe I could give you something not as an object, but as in like, I don't know how to give you laser vision though. Like maybe that's something I could do, but I don't know. But right now, let's just go ahead and give her a batarang and see if that works. Batarang, here you go. The power, whoa! Who is this? Gog? Arriving on Earth, Gog began to, began to heal people, including members of the Justice Society, telling everyone his intention was to save the planet, but in fact, this powerful being was attempting to enslave it. The JSA is able to defeat the, mon the monster with the help of the Kingdom Come Superman and imprison the monster in the surface wall where it will be imprisoned forever. Wow, seems scary. <laughs> wow. And he gets beat up by grandma. No, grandma, you were a great lady. Uh, help me play this arcade. All right, Amur needs assistance. I'll help you out. Defeat the ghoul and rescue the prince. I don't see either of those. Oh, right here. Defeat the ghoul, rescue the prince. So let's create another object. Let's go ahead and do uh, Katana. I know I do this one a lot, but it's just sort of easy to do. Hiya. One hit takedown? Okay, thanks for playing, 200 points. So let me go ahead and turn off the game. Oh no, it does it by itself. So we're making some good points so far. 2040, so we actually already have enough. We'll do one more just in case though. Stop the wick. Oh, no, oh, 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 that's what you meant. Um, Imminent bomb, remove adjectives. There you go. No, didn't work. Attack it. No, oh, sorry. Oh well. Help me, my picnic is ruined. Okay, I gotta beat up bugs. No, not you. Ah, oh, come on, you're in the way. I'm trying to save your picnic here. Oh, I did, okay, I'm out of here, see ya. <laughs> All right, so as you can see, we should have enough uh, favor to unlock the Teen Titans Tower next episode, though. That was a lot of fun, but also a little bit challenging going through Bell Reeve, which, like I said before, is actually a brand new level added to the Scribblenauts Mega Pack that wasn't in the original Scribblenauts Unmasked. Very interesting. And yeah, very cool. But for now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Scribble Knots Unmasked. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Super Zebra Sunny. You have watched at the end of the URA Zebra Tasking Viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. By the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.